Once you see how easy it is to find and keep track of internet recipes with cooking, you'll never go back. Instead of clicking on Internet Explorer or launching Firefox, I'm just going to double click on cooking here. Because cooking has a recipe browser built in that lets me search the web. All I do is I click here where it says Internet Recipe Search. I'm looking for a seven layer salad recipe. And now when I click here, cooking will actually go out and search the web and find the best recipes for you. And now I can click around just like I would if I were browsing the web. And I can look through. Go, okay, this looks like a good recipe. But let me keep looking here. This one looks interesting. There's no photo. I kind of like the photos. That's one I kind of like that photo. Let's try this. So, anyways, once you find a good recipe, what I do is I just click the capture button right here. And what we do is cook and scrapes the recipe content on that page and parses it into the different cooking fields for you. And it even captures the photo too. And so now I've got this recipe in my cooking software. And I can now go and save this in the Oaks Family Recipe Cookbook. And I'm going to put this in the salads chapter. And so that's this one right here. And watch when I click save here. There it is. There's the layered salad recipe that I found on the web. And with your recipe in cooking, you can do all kinds of things. You can adjust this recipe serving sizes. You can analyze nutritional value. You can combine the recipe to make a menu in a grocery shopping list or print it or email it or sync it with your mobile device or all kinds of things. It's awesome. It's way better than searching for it on Firefox or Internet Explorer because then when you find a recipe, what do you do with it? Most people print it. And after you print it, you end up with a lot of sheets of paper on your desk. You're burning through your ink cartridge. A lot of people write it down. But then you know you end up with a stack of papers on your desk and finding those recipes again is difficult. So searching for recipes on the web using cooking is the only way to go. I hope this helps. Have a great day.